with no place to go. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. if you'll be able to see but today's video I will show you how to fill your nails from home mine are looking really long and it's gel gel nail polish and acrylic nails first you want to get a drill I got this off of Amazon you want to try to get off all the polish and I'll show you pretty easy and it doesn't hurt. Comes right off. sure it's extra smooth. And to file your nail down shorter because it grew out, you want to shorten it. Now you use this, that from Amazon also, doubt you can see it, put these on your cuticle. Then you go wash your hands. I'll be right back. Okay, the next thing you want to use this, this. You can get these from the Dollar Tree, like a stack of them. Hope you can see better. I don't know if you can see these, but all on Amazon. And then this you can get off Amazon. It's in this container which is really nice so it keeps the smell in because this reeks and then you just use this you want to put it doesn't matter how much 
you put in here, I just fill it up to like here. This up with these plastic cups you can get from like the Dollar Tree. And then this I got from Amazon. Just want to swish it around so it's not so hard anymore. And then open this up. Sorry, the extension cord and my dog in the background. But I had to do this in the garage because it reeks. Okay, so then you want to hope you can see this until it looks like that and then you just plop it right onto your cuticle but you want to work fast because it dries really quick and then anything else you just take off this is like an eraser so take this and go outside the edges just so that there isn't anything left over. And then do it all over again. Okay. Until you think that there's enough. It doesn't have to be perfect. It took me forever. First couple times. Okay, eraser. Eraser. Sorry about that, I just switched spots. The sun went down. Okay, so now we're all dried. You have to, so you need your drill again. What you have to do is just drill it down, make sure all the new stuff that you just put down on your nails is nice and smooth now. So you just smooth it off. Take this, make sure everything is evened out. All done. And then the same process again, you have to use your buffer. Any, these are all the same sides, except for this. This is the smooth side, so you wanna buff it out first. This just makes it really nice and smooth to apply any um, nail polish. And then you wanna use the smooth side. And then it just makes it so smooth. No rough edges, anything. Super smooth. And then same thing for this side. You need to find this again. This right here you want to use one last time on the cuticles of your nail. Just right here. This just makes sure that everything bonds together and stays together. And then dip it again. You just dip it once and then do it to all of your nails. All of the cuticle parts. And then you want to wash your hands again and I'll be right back okay I'm back I just had to wash my fingernails um, don't use Dawn soap just use regular soft soap um, I forgot what it's called you can get it from like the Dollar Tree I'll have to show you but you just wash your hands make sure they're nice and dry and clean and then this I got off of Amazon 20 bucks to dry your nails um, very good deal. Here, I will put it right here, and then I'll show you. I have tons of nail polish I got off Amazon as well. This brand is so awesome for gel nails. This stuff will stick on forever, and it does not chip. I type all day long. I do so many things. with. I've done yard work with my nails, and they don't chip. Like, this stuff is bomb. Um, this one I'm using shade 064. It's a really, really pretty red. 
just in time for Christmas. It's like a dark red. But you need, this comes in a set. You get the base and you get the um, no wipe top. These two come together as a set. And I think they're $10 for the whole set, I believe. Um, but these two you need because the base is what you start out with. You do one coat, dry it for 30 minutes or 30 seconds. I'm so sorry. Dry it first. And then you want to put color, then dry 30 seconds. And then you do this. You can dry for 30 seconds after you add this coat, but I usually dry for 60 just in case to be on the safe side. But I'll show you the whole process. Um... So you start out with the base, I'll show you, base, and I got this once again off Amazon, shake it up, and then this you just want to do one thin coat, I hope you can see it, and make sure don't get it on your skin, or else it's going to dry really wonky. Just get it as close as you can. Doesn't have to be perfect. Sorry, my dogs, if you hear them, I'll show you. Just make sure there's nothing in the um, nail polish. And you wanna get the tip. And remember, this is the base. You're doing the base first for all the nails. Because this is what helps make um, the actual paint stick. And like I said, it doesn't have to be perfect. But make sure you get all the edges and everything. And there you go. First coat, put them in, and then hit 30. And just let them dry. Just 30 seconds. And then now they're tacky, so don't touch them or else you're gonna make fingerprints. Um, but make sure that the first coat's done. Then you wanna go with it, the actual polish. This one is the 064. And then I think on my ring nails, I'm gonna add some like glittery red. It's really pretty. But also shake them up if they've just been sitting around. But this one's like a glittery dark red, I'll show you hard to see on camera. And then this one is that dark red. And then once again, same thing. Just paint. This you might need a couple coats because it comes off kind of light, but you want to take your time. Some of the colors come out really dark and some just come out really light. That's just how they are. There we go, we've got one. And you want to dry 30 seconds. And then you want to add another coat. Oops. There we go. And then one more. 
black over this. The only bad thing is if you do mess up, <clears throat> what I do, I have to shave it off and start all over. Just shave the um, color off the paint and then you have to use this to smooth it out, use this to smooth it out and just start all over. It takes like two seconds, but you don't have to go through that process of putting all that other stuff on. And this is 30 seconds again. We're letting the second coat dry. And then once it's all dry, looks good. Then you want to do the no wipe top. No wipe top, that's what it's called. And then this will seal everything so it doesn't come off. Same thing. And um, I have more videos coming up of um, decorating my house with the lights, uh, Christmas lights. I also have, I have to decorate both my trees. So I'll show you that these things don't budge. They don't chip at all. And then just put that in here. Oh, I meant to do it for thir or 60. I always do it for 60 just in case. So I'll just do it another 30 seconds. But that's all it is, three steps. See, they're already dry, but I want to be on the safe side. See, they're cute. And then there's like a little sparkly one. You can't really see any of this. Yeah, but 30 seconds to be on the safe side. And then you just gotta do the same thing all over again and I'll speed past all this so you don't have to watch. Ta-da. Base, cause I didn't do my thumb. I usually do that last. seconds and then you want to move to your color after I wonder if this will focus right and then we're done then I want to do the color 30 seconds and I want one more coat because it's kind of thin after 30 seconds and then one more coat there that way it's not just um, a thin coat put it back in like I said you could do coffin shape any size that you want you just have to nail or um, file it down to how you want it what shape but like I said I work from home so I have to have like short nails to type right and then the last step is last step no wipe seconds and 
then I'll show you once these grow out and I need to take them off, I'll show you how to remove them with acetone. Um, I did see someone on YouTube try to remove their nails with um, toothpicks, these, and that hurts. I strongly don't recommend doing that. I tried it, yeah, it works, but it hurts. Like you're yanking it off from, hang on, I'll show you. Someone showed me to put it right here and then yank it down. And that hurts so bad, you have no idea. And it ruined my nails, like it rips them completely off, my real nails. So don't use that. But I like to try everything I can to see if there's an easier way, but this is definitely the easiest way. So yeah, these are all done. Wonder if I can hold something to show you. And they don't budge, I could do anything. They're perfectly fine. And like right when I took them out, they're perfectly fine, They nothing happened. But let me um, fast forward through this part and I will show you how to do these. Base again. And then one more coat. Then do these ears in a white top. Sorry about that, my camera died. Um, but these are the finished nails. I had to finish them without you while I was waiting for my camera to charge. But they turned out very, very good. They're sturdy, you could do whatever. It does not chip or anything. I love these so much. And online you can get so many different colors and everything. These I'm obsessed with. Oh, and also I didn't really like the um, glittery one that much, so I might end up shaving that off and just making it all the solid colors because I like that actually a lot better. I just thought I would try something new, but I don't really like that. Um, but it's cute if you do like all your nails that color, but I don't like that just single one. But anyways, off topic. Um, I will show you everything that you need for the set that I got off Amazon. Um, and I'll tell you all the prices, everything that I paid. So I'll include that right now. Okay, so the first thing that you need, this stuff, don't know if you could see it. This was off Amazon, it's $12 for a four ounce bottle. And this stuff you need for this powder, you have to dip this into this to bond onto your nails. And then there's this to remove your nails. Sorry if you hear my dogs in the background. Um, this is acetone to remove your nails without any, it doesn't hurt you or anything. It's a very easy removal process. That was $10 off Amazon for eight fluid ounce. And if you have Prime, it comes to you ASAP. For a single nail polish for color, it kind of, it went up on Amazon. I just looked at the price, they're $7 now for a single color but you can buy packs of them i believe you get like i bought like a pack of five or six it comes with five or six all different shades and um it's a variety pack and it's 18 dollars, which i think it was like 17.99 but that i think is a much better deal since they're seven a piece so you get a ton for that much and then these that's dirty um these right here are the top white Okay, no wipe top, can't read. And then this one is base. Sorry if everything's dirty, I've been using it like crazy. Um, but these two come together as a package deal, so they're five bucks a piece, but they come together on Amazon for $10. So that's a really good deal. And these last forever, you don't have to replace them. There's a ton in here. And then this, um, it's so dirty and I do apologize. It has like nail polish all over. But the UV LED light, this was, 
let me check, $21 off Amazon, and that you need to dry your nails. But I'm sure they have cheaper versions on Amazon, so you don't have to get exactly what I got, but this stuff has worked for me. That's just what I'm suggesting. And then this comes in a package. This is a, if it wouldn't, okay, it was a little blurry, sorry. But this comes as a package. All of this comes together. It's called a, um, let me see, electric nail drill bit set. And that was $20. It comes with tons of refills, which you go through these, not quick, but these, um, it comes with, it comes with that cute little thing. And then it comes with more drill sets, drill sets, a little brush and the actual drill itself. Comes with this and these you can replace the little heads and then it plugs in so you can use it. And the good thing is I've seen nail techs where they have to put their foot on it in order to make it work. This, you literally just turn it on and there's two settings. One is really high, which obviously you don't want. And one is like a slower setting, but this is way better than the actual pedal thing. I don't know how people do that, <laughs> but that comes all together. And that I think is such a good deal because you get a lot and I haven't, the only time I've replaced this is probably once. And that I've had this stuff since I believe March. The next thing are the nails, the actual fake nail set. For a 500 piece, you get it's $6 off Amazon. And you can get the white set, which I got also to do like a French manicure, but I haven't done that yet. That's something that I wanna learn how to do as well. Um, and then obviously the cups. These I use all the time. These are from the Dollar Tree. They're only a dollar for a whole bunch of them. And then these nail clippers, once you glue on the fake nails, you want to clip them or if you want to leave them super long, that's up to you. But these are, let me see, nail clipper. They were $6, which I love these. They work really well. And then the last thing that you need is the buffer. Um, this actually comes all together as well. I got a lot of kits to start out with and that I strongly suggest because um, it comes with everything you need. This nail kit was, let me see, nail secret kit was $18. And this thing, it came in this cute little clear bag and I will show you everything it comes with. It comes with so much stuff, if I can open it. I should have just left it open. Hang on one second. <laughs> okay, so it comes with this stuff, the powder to fill in your nails, or if you apply the nails where they put the powder on and this stuff. But it comes with this, and it comes with a mini version of this stuff as well, which I already went through. But it comes with a mini one of those. It comes with this stuff, the ultra bonding. It comes with really good nail glue for your fake nails, the acrylics. It comes with the brush that you have to apply this stuff with. It comes with this. It comes with an extra buffer. It comes with a nail filer. And then it also comes with a set of fake nails. That I think is an amazing deal for, what was it? Uh, let me check. $18, you get everything to start out. And this stuff has lasted me forever. The only thing I, I did lie, I did replace something and it was this. I had to get more of this because I was doing like my mom's nails. Um, she wanted me to try out hers, she really liked it. So I kind of went through that little bottle, but I can't get so much stuff. But the, another thing extra that I got on the side, I got extra glue just in case I need it. I bought this which is not a lot on Amazon. And then I bought an extra um, brush. And then I'll show you more. This thing I think works so well and it has a container so that it like keeps the smell in. But this is amazing. I like this brush a lot. And that is all I used to buy all, this nail, all these nails. They were, um, roughly it's around $100. I haven't added it all up, but I'm sure it's like close to 100 maybe a little less, but that's pretty good for all this stuff. And it's lasted me so long. If you have any other questions or anything, just let me know. Thanks for watching.